All right, take two, let's try this again. Uh, another voltage drop, uh, testimonial, reasons to voltage drop stuff, that kind of thing. I got a 21 Nissan Rogue, that was a flood car. I know, don't work on flood cars, but I am. So, he has a bunch of lights for uh, 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 ADOS problems. I do a scan, I got no communication with the sonar module, which is in the back of the car, which probably got flooded. Um, and all the other modules are ratting it out saying, hey, you know, no communication with sonar module. So I come back here and I can't talk to it. I check powers and grounds and communication, right? So I get this lavender and uh, green wire right there. Now I'm going to, I'm going to do nothing. I'm going to block this thing. I know don't front probe, but I am. But if you can look. I'm gently front probe. I got no test light. Interesting, right? So I come back. And I said, well, that wire, that, uh, my lavender and green, I, I pierced it over here just in case something's broken in here. I know the fuse that powers this also powers a bunch of other modules that do work. And I checked the fuse anyway up front, all the way up front under the dash, 10 amp fuse, number 40. It is good. I said, well, I'm broken somewhere. Okay, so I come, let me drop all my stuff here come back here and I said let me throw my meter on it real quick and when you know it I got 12 volts I said well maybe my test light's bad so I checked my test light my test light's good it's not my test light so I go back and I said well that's odd let me just gently front probe it again and I still got no light but I also lost my voltage no light I pull out and 14 volts the whatever that is maybe a 300 milliamp bulb is enough to pull the circuit down so I'm guessing somewhere upstream that thing's corroded and it's enough to pull the circuit down now I gotta go find it but reason number 62 and a half to low test your circuits that's it